What do we mean by research? Well, this is paint. A few years ago, in projects for the EPA, big issue was no VOCs. That was the industry was trying to figure out how do you make good no VOC paints and stains. That problem's pretty well been solved now. They have basic paints, basic stains. Now the specialty niches are being addressed because the performance standards are higher and there's a trade-off between what you can do with no VOC materials and what you can do with toxic and other VOC type materials. So you're trying to get rid of the toxins, the VOCs and the research now but attain the same performance. Things like, uh, and you see it in others like uh, replacements for chrome, coatings. We don't think of paints anymore, we think of coatings because we're coating stuff and there's crossover between paints and other materials, polymers, all sorts of things. Uh, plastics, foams, who knows, you know, it's just, the issue is how do I coat something, give it the properties I want. So I'm looking for the functionality when I'm looking for research and then it's not hard to find it. I search databases of referee research that I get access to through my university public library or I just buy myself. I pick up the phone and I call federal R&D funding people or whatever country I'm in, the people who hand out the money and review proposals, issue RFPs, those kind of guys, because they see a lot of stuff and they'll tell you in general what's going on. I may talk to some experts in a government laboratory who are working the problem because I'm a taxpayer, I'm paying their salary, dang it. They'll talk to you. They're nice people. They like talking to you. They won't tell you confidential stuff, but they're glad to talk. And then I look some other places. I look at university industry centers, and I like to see what's being given in, uh, as presentations at professional meetings in the papers, because that's where some of the early stuff shows up. You can go to preprints and other places for that. So that's how I figure out what's going in on, on competition for research. I'm always interested, is there anything four square, just whoop, exactly like what I'm doing? And how are the other ways of solving the problem? And what of these are likely to be commercially viable within five, 10, whatever my horizon is from the period of market introduction? So that's what I do when I'm looking for research. I'm trying to figure out who's got something coming down the pike. Oh, one other issue. Always interesting to find out if there's industry money going in already because that tells you something about who your competition is or your potential licensee, one or the other.